Hey guys, how's it going? Josh from LiveCA Chartered Accountant at www.liveca.ca. Uh, in today's video blog, I want to show you guys how to file your GST or HST return online using the GST HST net file system. Uh, so let's take a look how to do this. All right, so let's do a Google search here for GST HST net file. And it should be the first option that comes up in the listing. Uh, so here is your GST HST net file screen. Um, but to go ahead and do the, the net file, you're going to need an access code. So let me show you what uh, the GST return looks like that you get in the mail. So this, you should arri this should arrive in the, uh, in the standard Canada Post mail. Uh, you've got your due date up here when the return is due, your business number that usually ends in RT0001 for GST HST, and your reporting period, uh, so when the period uh, begins and ends, if it's annual or quarterly or monthly. And then here in this section here will be your four-digit access code. Uh, the rest of the GST return is going to be uh, the same, so your s total sales here, uh, HST that you collected, and uh, input tax credit, so GST, HST that you paid. Um, so let's go back to the net file screen here. Uh, so assume you've got that in the mail, um, you can go and click ready to file. If you don't have that, uh, then you just click on get, need an access code, and um, you can follow the steps to get one. Uh, so let's go to ready to file. So, yeah, we've got an access code, um, and this stuff is, uh, you know, it's uh, enabled on our browser, and I've completed the return, so we know how to fill out a GST HST return, let's say. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, continue here. So all these details are going to be available on that return that comes in the mail. So we talked about the business number and the reporting period and that access code. The rest of these things here are probably not going to apply if you're a typical small business. So I would just say no. If you're not sure, if you're really not sure and you've got a complicated return, uh, get in touch with your accountant. Uh, same thing goes on all these uh, uh, points here. Again, if you're doing a standard small business uh, GST, HST return, these are probably not going to reply. Same with recapturing tax credits. But if you're not sure, please get in touch with your accountant. Um, so I'm going to click on no here. And I'm going to say uh, continue or next. Now, I can't do anything here because I haven't put in the information. Um, but I'll just show you, once you do all this, uh, you're going to get to a screen that shows this. And I've blocked out the information number, but you'll have the business name, business number, reporting period, and the filing date. And then it will ask you to put in the total sales um, and the total HST, GST, HST collected, the total input tax credits, and the adjustments. Basically the same screen as you've got here, and you just have to do it online. Uh, once you do that, there will be a button that says Calculate. And once you click on Calculate uh, and you say OK, you'll get this confirmation. This is the final confirmation that you can then print. Uh, and it will have here all the details um, from the online GST, HST net file system. And uh, once you click OK and you get this confirmation, you're done. So no mailing in or anything like that. Just make sure you then go and pay the balance either using the CRA's My Payment System or any other payment option that you've decided to use. Uh, so that's it. Any questions about filing the GST, HST uh, online, shoot me an email at josh at liveca.ca. That's it. Hope this helped. Thanks, guys.